so hey youtube family welcome back to the video i hope you guys are doing extremely well so friends in this video i will discuss 20 most important and frequently asked mcqs of unit number 3 which is central processing unit as we have already discussed 20 most important mcqs of unit number 1 and unit number 2 already so if you guys haven't watched that videos then please you can go to the description box where you will find the link of that both the videos all the 60 questions which i am discussing for this subject is important do not skip any of the questions and without wasting any time let's proceed with the first question which is which of the architecture is power efficient option number a risk option number b isa and second last option is iana and last option is sys so the correct option of this question is option number a which is risk what does CSA stands for? Question number two, what does CSA stand for? Option number A, computer service architecture. Option number B, computer speed addition. Option number C, carry save addition. And last option is none of the mentioned. And the correct option of this question is option number B, which is computer speed addition. Question number three is in CISC architecture, most of the complex instructions are stored in what? CMOS, option number B is register, option number C is transistors and last option is diodes. And the correct option of this question is option number C which is transistor. Let's proceed to the fourth number question which is both the CISC and RISC architecture have been developed to reduce the what? Option number A, time delay. Option number B, semantic gap. Option number C, cost. And last option is all of them answered. So the correct option of this question is option number B, which is semantic gap. Fifth number question, which bus is used to specify memory locations for the data being transferred? Option number A, control bus. Option number 2 is data bus. Option number 3, address bus and last option is input output bus. And the correct option of this question is option number C which is address bus. Next question, which of the following register contain, contain the instruction to be executed in CPU? Option number A, index register. Option number 2, instruction register. Option number 3, memory data register. And last option is memory address register. And the correct option of this question is option number 2, which is instruction register. Okay. Next question. Which one of the following is a special characteristics of risk processor? Very important question. Option number A. Provide direct manipulations of operands residing in memory. Option number 2. A large variety of addressing modes. Option number 3, a variable length instruction format and last option is overlapped register window. And the correct option of this question is option number 4 which is overlapped register window. Next question, what is risk S stand for? It's a very simple question and option is remaining instruction set of compiler. Option number 2, remaining intermediate stories of computer. Option number 3, reduced intermediate storage of computer. And last option is reduced instruction set computer. And the correct option is option number D, which is reduced instruction set computer. Nine number question. A microprogrammed control unit, option number 1, is faster than a hardware unit. Option number 2, facilities easy implementation of a new instruction. Option number 3 is useful when a small programs are to be run and last option is all of the above and the correct option of this question is option number 2 which is facilities easy, impl uh, facilities easy implementation of a new instruction. Tenth number question. The technology that stores only the essential instruction on a microprocessor chip and thus enhance its speed is referred to as option number A CISC, option number 2 SIMD, option number 3 RISC and last option is MIMD and the correct option of this question is option number 3 which is RISC. 11th number question. 
the reduced instruction set computer characteristics are option number characteristics of we can say characteristics of reduced instruction set computers four statements are there first statement single cycle instruction execution option number b a uh, sorry statement number b variable length instruction format and third statement is instructions that manipulates operands in memory and last statement is efficient instruction pipeline and we have to choose the correct characteristics from the option given above okay so the correct option of this question is option number three because a statement number a and a statement number d are correct okay question number 12 pipeline is a unique feature of what risk CISC, iec or iana correct option is risk okay very simple question next question is the top of the stack can be denoted by what program counter address register second last option is a stack pointer and last option is instruction register and the correct option of this question is option number C, which is a stack pointer. 14th number question. Each operation has its dash opcode, unique opcode, or two opcode, or three opcode, or four opcode. And the correct option is option number A, which is unique opcode. Means each operation has its unique opcode. Okay. 15th number question. Which register holds the address for a stack whose value is supposed to be directed to the topmost position? Option number A, a stack pointer. Option number B, a stack register. C option is both and B. And last option is none of the above. And the correct option is option number A, which is a stack pointer. 16th number question. The load instruction is mostly used to designate a transfer from memory to a processor register known as what option number a accumulator option number b is instruction register and second last option is program counter and last option is memory address register and correct option is option number a which is accumulator 17th number question the computer architecture aimed at reducing the time of execution of instruction is what? Option number A is CISC. Option number B is RISC. Third option is ISA. And last option is A and NA. And correct option is option number B, which is RISC. Third last question of this entire session the addressing mode which makes use of in direction pointer is. Option number A, indirect addressing mode, index addressing mode, relative addressing mode or offset addressing mode. And correct addressing mode is indirect addressing mode. Okay. Second last question, which characteristics of accumulator is of greater significance in terms of functionality? And option number A is ability to store one of the operands before the execution of an instruction and b number option is ability to store the result after the execution of an instruction and c option is both hand b and last option is none of the above and the correct option is both hand b okay and last question of this entire session is what is the status of a stack pointer for the execution of push and pop operation Option is it gets post decremented for post and pre incremented for pop. Second option it gets pre incremented for post and post decremented for pop. Second last option is it gets pre incremented for post as well as pop. And last option is it gets post decremented for push as well as pop. And the correct option is option number B, which is it gets pre incremented for push and post decremented for pop so that's all for this session thank you so much for watching the videos and if you guys enjoyed watching the videos then do not forget to subscribe the channel and also do not forget to share this video to your friends and classmates thank you so much guys bye bye